What's happening, y'all? I just came from the barber shop. Just got my hair cut. Got my hair cut. Um. Yeah, I'm. I'm feeling. I'm feeling kind of. Uh, starting to feel kind of bad again, cause. Um. You know, I'm, I'm just feeling. I'm feeling a little low. Like I, you know, like I did before. Cause uh. You know, I'm going to school. You know, still. I go to school. And it's just. I just. No matter how much I talk about, you know, trying to, like, sometimes in the comments section, I always talk about, you know, tell people that I always try to, my best to stay positive and try not to, you know, I try to, basically, I, I comment on other people's, uh, on, on other people's posts when they be saying that they feel the same way, they feel like they can't find no girls, and I always try to, you know, I always try to, you know, make them feel better by, you know, making myself, I'll, I'll try to make them so feel better while at the same time trying to make myself feel better. And I don't really think it's working because, you know, I go to school and I still feel the same. Like, I go to school and, and, and girls, you know, it's just, it's always about girls, man. It's like the girls just don't notice me at all. Like, that's, that's what really makes me feel bad. And then on top of that, I'll be seeing all these guys you know, around, around my age, you know, dressed up, dressed all, you know, with their pants hanging off their, off their butts, and, you know, I don't dress like that, I, I don't, I don't like, I'm not that type of person, I'm not that type of person that, that, you know, I don't carry myself like that, and, like, I just, it just really, and then on top of that, like, girls, it seems like girls like that, and then girls like the, those type of guys that's real hood, like, you know, like, that's real, you know, I, I don't know, it has that, has that, you know, that ghetto demeanor, and I, I just, I don't like, I don't like those, those yo type boys, I don't, I'm just not that type of person, people might perceive me as that type of person, but, I mean, a lot of, it's a lot of stereotypes, so a lot of people may think that I'm like those type of guys, but I'm not, I'm not, I'm different, I'm different from a lot of guys, whether you believe it or not, you know, I listen to different music, I have different taste in music, I, my taste in music is is a lot different from a lot of people that I know, like, there's a lot of people that I know that don't like the same music that I like, because, like, with me, is I, I like music that a lot of people might, might not have never heard of, or stuff that's that's really like I don't know like underground you know I don't listen to mainstream all that garbage on the radio I don't listen to that crap but anyway I'm getting a little off topic um I'm just feeling I'm feeling kind of uh you know depressed because like I just like everything that I do like when I'm out I just feel like everybody is like against me like I just feel like everybody's against me like um every little thing that I do like if I like if I'm on the like I'm on the bus I get I catch the bus to school all the time and people on the bus are like they give you that that look like I don't know they just they just act mean most of most of the people on the bus act mean and I just don't that's why I hate catching the bus that's one of the main reasons why I hate catching the bus and like Every little thing that I do, like every move that I make, it seems like people are always looking at me like, like what is he doing? Why is he doing that? Like they don't say that, but I just get that feeling, you know. It's it's just I have a problem with trying not not to care what other people think. That's that's my problem. I need to stop caring what other people think. And that's that's my biggest problem. And um, what else am I kind of uh, feeling bad about? Um. You know, just just little stuff. It just it really it really gets to me. Like I just don't like how you know other guys get all these cute looking girls. You know these guys that that's probably just going to school just n not even to just to go to school just to I don't know to show off or whatever. They're not really going to school to learn. 
I'm going to school to get my education so I can, um, you know, I'm trying to get my education so I can, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, I can't think of the word, but, you know, I'm trying to better myself. I'm trying to get my education so I can live a good life and, you know, just hopefully live a good life and hopefully finally get a, a, a girlfriend or a wife or something, you know. Hell, that probably, I'll probably still be single by that time, by the time I finish college, by the time I graduate. Um, by the time I graduate to a four, from a four-year college, right now I'm at a two-year college. It's a, just a community college. It's not that big, but, um, yeah, I just, I just feel, I feel really low. Like, I'm, I try my best to make myself feel good. You know, I try to, you know, I try to feel confident. I try to, you know, feel good about myself, you know, when I'm around other people that I don't know. It's hard to do that. It's really hard. It's a challenge. And, you know, what what makes me feel even worse is just, just the whole, the whole fact of me feeling this way is just, you know, girls just not paying me no attention. Like, I, I get more attention from old people than people my age, you know. I just don't, I don't understand why old people stare at me more than younger people do, I, I just don't get it, I don't get it, like, I, I really, it doesn't make any sense, like, it's just backwards, like, maybe, maybe if I was old, maybe younger people would look at me more than, than the older people do, maybe, maybe that would happen if, if I, maybe I should just become old, so, just so the younger people can, can look at me, the younger girls, in particular, it's just, it's just backwards, but, um, what else do I want to talk about, um, oh, uh, yesterday, um, you know, I felt, I felt bad about, yesterday, I, I didn't, I didn't, uh, I couldn't make a video yesterday because I came home late, but, um, you know, yesterday, some things happened, some good, well, one good thing happened, and some things that made me a little jealous, um, you know, yesterday was just a reg just another regular day in school. Um, you know, I, I, uh, what happened yesterday? Oh, I saw I saw a cute Asian girl in the lob. I was in the library and I saw this cute Asian girl. And um, you know, I wanted to say something to her, but I was too hesitant to say something. So, you know, plus I had to get ready to go to class. I had to go to class when I saw her, so I had to I had to think of something quick before it was time to go to class. So I just decided to just give her a compliment. I just walked up to her. I was nervous as hell, don't, don't get me wrong. I was nervous when I did it, but you know, I did it. And so I just said, um, I just said, you, you look very beautiful. And she turned around, smiled and said, thank you. And I just walked away, that was it. That was, that was, that was, that was it. I would've, I would've took it a little further, but I had to go, so. I just left it, I just left it, you know, left it alone, I just left it at that, but, um, what else, um, and then I saw her again later, I saw her again later on th throughout the day in the library, and she saw me, didn't, and then and this time she didn't say nothing, she acted as if I didn't say anything to her earlier, like, she just, I don't know, she just didn't say anything, and I didn't say nothing to her. When she saw me, she just saw me and just kept it kept it moving. You know, it wasn't no interaction the second time I saw, we saw each other. But, um, you know, I felt, a little, I felt like that was, that was a red flag when she didn't say nothing to me. But I guess she wasn't supposed to. I mean, I, I was the one that gave her the compliment. I don't know, but, um... You know, she was leaving out the library when, when I saw her. And um, what else happened? And I saw one of my, my friends from school and I, I, I ran into one of his friends, it was a female, and all three of us was talking. And they was, I remember in our, con in our conversation, we had a discussion. 
Well, they was talking about how they met each other. Well, no, 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 no. It, it was it was two d- discussions that they had. They was talking about the boy was talking about how he was trying to talk to this girl that he likes, and he found out, and 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 I found out that the girl he likes likes him too and when I found that out I was I was just jealous cause like he talks to a lot of girls like he has a lot of female friends and he was talking about he trying to get on a, on go on a date with this girl and all this stuff and, but he but yet he said he feels just like me like how can you feel just like me and you got all these female friends and you uh you know you got a girl you know trying to go on a date with a girl, you know, I just, that just made me feel bad, I feel, I felt jealous when I found that out, and, um, you know, the, the girl was, and then the girl was talking to, um, my friend, and they was having, they was telling me about how they met each other, and the girl was telling, telling me that he, that she, at first, she had a crush on my friend, but she didn't really, like she found well, I don't want to get into too much detail, but the fact of, the fact is they she said that she had a crush on him at first, and that's how they became you know friends. But they didn't they didn't actually like each other you know like that. They just became friends somehow. But I don't know. I barely really I barely know the girl. So um, I met him through her. I mean I met her through him. So. Um, I didn't meet her initially, but, um, yeah, that, that made me feel kind of bad when I found that out, you know, it's, it's, it seemed like no girls, no girls in my school found me attractive at all, like, I feel like I'm just, I don't know, I just feel like I'm just ugly, like, I'm, I'm only, I'm only attractive to older people, like, old, old people, and that don't, I don't count that, like, I don't, I don't, I don't count that older people being attracted to me like that's that that shit don't count that shit don't count um i want i want younger young, younger females to, to be attracted to me and, and it's just not happening it's just not happening like I, I just don't i just don't know what it is like it seemed like it seemed like i look at all these uh these youtube videos about how to approach girls and um, you know, all this other stuff, and then they always say that it, when you have confidence, it always works. I have the confidence. I talk to these girls. Girls still don't like me. Like it's, it's me. It, it can't be. It can't be the way I'm coming off. It's just. It's just me. My pre. It's just. It's just me. Me being me. You know, I just. It's just. I was born. I think I. I, I might have. I probably was born for girls not to like me. I was born a reject, you know. Maybe, maybe the the Almighty Creator, maybe He decided that maybe I shouldn't, females shouldn't be attracted to me, and I should just, you know, live live my, you know, be alone for the rest of my life. Maybe maybe I was meant to be single forever. But you know, that's just how I feel. Like I'll be trying to approach these girls, and I'm not going to give up. I'm still not going to give up. That don't mean, just because I feel like girls don't like me, don't mean I'm going to give up. I'm going to still keep trying to talk to girls. But I still feel like there's still, there's still no hope. But I'm going I'm to keep trying to see what happens. See see if, it, see if I get lucky. Because, like, it seems like no girls, no girls like me. Like, I just feel like I'm just, I'm just ugly. I'm, I'm, I'm just an ugly, you know, I'm, I'm like the ogre from Shrek. That's that's how that's how I look. I look just like the ogre from Shrek. That's probably why girls don't like me, cause I look like him. You know, I, I just I feel I just feel like a piece of crap right now. You know, I, I I try to I try to you know feel good about myself. I try to feel confident when I'm not just around girls, but just people in general. Cause sometimes when I'm around just regular people. You know, I don't even have to be girls, you know, sometimes I, f- I feel, you know, I just feel like they, they against me, you know, I just feel like the whole world is against me, that's how I feel, like the whole world is against me, even my own family sometimes, my parents, like, I 
I just feel like everybody is just my enemy. And I just... I'm just tired. I'm just tired of feeling like this, man. I'm, I'm really tired. Like something's got to something's got to happen. You know, I'm 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 determined to, you know, better myself and become a better person. But you know, I, I just feel like I just right now. And then another thing that's that's making me kind of upset is this biology class that I'm taking. I'm taking this biology class and I'm not doing too well. Like I, I failed the first three quizzes and I'm not doing too well. And this is my last semester. If I don't, if I don't pass these classes, I might not be able to graduate. So all my professors are, are holding my diploma right now. So, well, not my diploma, but my degree. They hold my degree right now. And if, if I don't pass these classes, I'm not. I'm probably going to be stuck in the same college that I'm at right now. And and then, and on top of that, I might I'm gonna get kicked out of my uh, the uh, scholarship program that I'm in right now. So I really have to step my game up with with this biology because I, I really don't want to fail this class. And I, I think it's too late to drop classes. I think it's I, I'm not sure. I have to check in with my advisor if it if it's uh if it's whether or not it's too late to find out if it's too late. But um. I mean, I took I took a, a quiz that I failed last week. He my teacher let us retake it again today, and I think I did a little bit better this time. But I'm I hope I pass. You know, I hope I pass. And and oh, oh yeah, and another thing I saw the Mex I saw the Mexican girl once again. You know she she just keep leaving. You know she's so quick to leave the class. Like I just don't understand. You know I just feel I'm just I'm just gonna give up, man. I'm not gonna talk to her. I give up. I can't. I just cannot find the opportunity to talk to this girl because she's so freaking fast to leave the class, and and I just, I just cannot. Uh, I can't never get the chance to talk to her. So fuck it, you know. And then the Dominican girl, she ain't show up today. I, she hasn't showed up all week. I don't know what happened to her. Hope she ain't dropped the class. It seemed like the Mexican girl only show up on Wednesdays. She never show up Mondays, for for whatever reason. I don't know, but um, yeah, it's weird. But I just, I don't I just don't know why this the Mexican girl just keep leaving. You know, every time when I'm trying to talk to her, I'm like when we was taking our test, we we was taking our test, and right after we we uh was done, like after we finished our test, we could leave the class. I was finished before her, before she was, but I wanted to wait until she was about to leave. But she was already close to the front, to the uh, to the door. So she handed in her her test. I'm trying to hurry up and pack my stuff up so I can hurry up and talk to her. She already out the door while while I'm packing my stuff. And I'm like, oh come on, you serious again? So you know, I I just give up, man. At this point, I just give up. She probably won't like me anyway, so. She'll probably be just like the rest of them. You know, why? I mean, I would have tried to talk. To, I mean, I tried to talk to her, but she just, she's just too fast. I never even heard her say, I don't, she's very quiet. Like, she don't say anything in the class. Like, she's very quiet. I haven't heard her say one, one word. And, you know, I just, I just give up. She just, she's too hard to, it's like I'm, it's like I'm trying to, I'm trying to think of a good analogy. Like it's like I'm trying to, like, it's like I'm trying to reach for, um, like I'm trying to reach for, um, I don't know. I can't think of a good analogy, but you you get what I'm trying to say. It's it's just hard to it's hard to um, uh, it's hard to talk to this girl. So I'm just going to just give up and not talk to her at this point because she just. I guess she's just not worth. She's probably not worth my time anyway. <laughs> Barely showing up to class, you know. I don't have time for it. But the girl is cute though. I ain't gonna lie. She's very pretty. Dominican girl is too. I don't know what happened to her. I hope she. I was talking to her, the Dominican girl. You know, me and her was cool at first, but you know, I don't know what happened. She's not showing. She hasn't showed up all week. I ain't seen her since last week. But hopefully, she come back next next week. But um, hopefully.
hopefully I see her next week, but, uh, that's just, that's, you know, that's all I wanted to talk about, I feel, you know, I just feel like, I just feel like crap, I feel like crap, and, you know, I just, I don't know, man, I just feel, I feel low, like, girls, girls in my school, they don't, they don't pay me no attention, they don't, they don't stare at me, I don't get any signs, you know, I don't get, I don't get shit, like, I literally don't get anything, like, the only person that stares at me that I really cannot stand, like, I really, I really cannot stand this woman, is this old ass, this old ass lady in the library, like, every time she see me, she always got a freaking smile on her face, and it pisses me the fuck off, I cannot stand it, like, that's the only person that I see that be having, like, a little grin. But she, it seems like she be smiling at, like, everybody, though, not just me. I don't know. Maybe she, that maybe that's just how she is. But I just hate it when she be when she be staring at me, like, sometimes. But, like, she be sitting there on, on the, uh, at her desk just looking around at people. And then she be seeing me and be looking at me. Like, leave me alone, old woman. I don't want you. I don't want your old ass. Leave me the hell alone. You know, I just, I just hate, I, I just don't like, like it when old people think I'm good looking. I, I just do not like that. I don't appreciate that. I do not appreciate it. Like, I just, I cannot stand it. I don't, I don't even count that. If, if old people look, if old people find me attractive, I wonder what, what younger, what younger people see in me. They, they must think that I'm some old looking person just like them. Maybe that's why younger people don't like don't younger girls don't find me attractive because they think that I look like an old a old seventy year old man. They probably think that's that's probably why girls don't like me. That's probably why. That's probably the reason why girls don't like me because I'm because I'm too old. But yeah, that's I just I don't know. I just feel like I just feel like the whole the whole weight of the world is just on my shoulders. Everybody's just against me. Everybody's just my enemy. You know, I can't, I can't really, you know, I, I have some friends in my school, but I don't see them all the time, and I don't really have any friends in any of my classes. None, in any of my classes, I don't have not one, well, there was a Dominican girl, we became, we just became friends, but I don't know what happened to her, she stopped showing up for class. Well, this just been just for this week, I just hope it don't be for the rest of the semester, but, um. You know, hopefully, hopefully I see her again next week. But um, I don't have any friends in any in any of my classes. Not not one. Besides the Dominican girl, I don't have no no other friends. None. It's just it's just me, 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 me. I'm I'm all alone. All alone. What you see now is what is what is the only person that I'm with. When I'm in school, this person that you see right now is the person that's 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 with me when I'm in school, 24/7. This is the only friend I have is myself, nobody else, besides the Dominican girl. But you know, but uh, you know that's just that's all I wanted to talk about in this video. Um, yeah, um, my next video I might talk about something, something a little more positive, something, something that's not uh, similar to my other videos that I've made previously. Cause like, I'm gonna be making videos talking about, you know, s stuff that I'm going through, and also stuff that I like, like maybe like a, like video games, TV shows, stuff like that. I mean. That's that's just I'm just gonna talk about random st anything that that comes to my mind you know I'm gonna just talk about it um but yeah that's all I wanted to talk about in this video all right peace out.